Here is another question that I received from one of our viewers who is having a difficult time figuring out the total rise, the vertical measurement between the upper level and the lower level to figure out the individual riser height on an exterior set of stairs. The individual is building a new house and they need a stairway to make the construction process easier for anyone going upstairs instead of climbing up a ladder. And I get it. Build a temporary set of stairs if you cannot figure out where the lower level is going to be located. And you can stop watching the video right there if you want to. I'm just going to provide you with a few different examples of what you could run into if you do not know the height of the lower level because you don't know where the driveways are going to go you don't know where the sidewalks are going to go you don't know where anything is going to be located 100 percent until you're done with the building and of course here's a situation you could run into if you build the stairway before you know where the top of the sidewalk is going to be located you're going to end up with a small riser if the sidewalk and the landscaping fill needs to be a little bit higher than you anticipated. And of course, here's what would happen if the fill was going to be lower and your sidewalk, your patio, your porch, or your driveway was going to be lower. And this is actually something that I don't run into very often. And it's difficult to figure out if it's actually a repair where they needed to cut off a lower section of the stairway because of wood rot damage or termites, or whether it was a grading problem where someone didn't know the vertical rise for the stairway. And usually when I run into it, the riser heights are going to be different. I don't think I've ever came across one of these that use the height of the existing risers in the new section of the stairs they built. And of course, for those of you who do have a situation like this where the soil is lower, it's not higher, then you might be able to install a landing here. If you're going to change the riser height, then you could probably install a landing here to where you have two different flights of stairs. And of course, you would need to check with your local building authorities, building department, contractors, engineers, architects, to see if something like this would be allowed in your area. And as I already stated in the video, my recommendation for something like this would be to build a temporary set of stairs that could be removed and replaced by a permanent set of stairs because your construction workers are going to be a lot more happier and you're going to get a little bit more work done if they're going up a nice comfortable stairway instead of a dangerous ladder to access an upper floor or upper level.